what's up guys where Geeky Play is here back with another video and today I'm going to I'm going to show you how to reduce latency on some games but I'm sure it'll work for a lot of games like TF2, Elder Scrolls, you know, all those games and for some reason I found this article on Elder Scrolls like that like the website or whatever but yeah it was kind of surprising but it helped me a lot and and then re reduced well it helped me in Minecraft basically but okay so open up your command prompt admin and i just put it there because i'm too lazy to go on the website but yeah all right put this command in be up here while i'm typing so you should be able to type what it said table and then put, and i'll say okay now exit out of that and the next step you need to do is open up this and this is for windows 8 only because they made it really complicated on Windows 8 for some reason. So, but, all right, go on, click here, file, open Windows PowerShell as administrator, and put, and type in get hyphen net TCP setting. All right, so, um, Make sure the congestion provider is CTCP, and make sure it's, yeah, just CTCP. You need to only need to worry about, like, the setting name, internet. You only need to worry about this. Make sure it's enabled, like, right here, and if it's not, then you need to um, do the step again. Go to command prompt, admin, put this command in, but yeah. Next, um, type in get hyphen net tc net, um, wait. TCP connection and boom these will pop up you don't need to worry about those it just shows like the ports you use and blah 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 whatever but just exit out of that and, and restart but I already did uh, um, just to check it so again open up command prompt admin and put in this interface or just put int TCP show global and make sure um, ENC capability is enabled and if you're seeing add-on congestion control provider is none don't worry about it it's it's a bug that it shows for some reason it doesn't show its correct state so don't worry about it it's enabled but it just says none cuz you know Windows 8 is being just stupid right now it's a bug but um yeah, that's basically how to enable it. It'll definitely help on a lot of games. But if it doesn't work for some reason, just leave a comment and I'll definitely reply. But yeah, hope that helped you guys. And I just decided to upload this because no one on YouTube uploaded this for some reason. And I just, it just seems like it'll help a lot of people. But yeah, leave, leave a like and comment if it did help you. And please leave some support. Please support my channel and subscribe. And I will be uploading a lot more tutorials and videos. And, um, yeah. Peace.